Welcome back to this Resolume Arena tutorial. In this tutorial, we'll be discussing locking content. This is going to be a short one, so let's dive right in. Let's start by locking a layer. Locking content on a layer lets you secure the content playing in a specific layer. It's perfect from preventing accidental changes during live performances. To lock the content on a layer, right click the layer name and select Lock Content. You will see a lock icon appear over the thumbnail indicating it's secured. When I try to modify the content on the layer, Arena will simply not obey. I cannot trigger other clips, eject the layer, or even clear the clip. When I try to replace the clip, Arena will refuse. And as expected, column triggers are also ignored. Note that the content is locked, not the layer. I can still modify the layer opacity. Locking content on a group works similar. Right click the group and select lock content. This will apply the lock content action to all layers. With this knowledge, you should be locked and loaded for your next gig. Locking content is a great way to prevent accidents during live shows. I personally have found it very useful when introducing new VJs to a live show. I would lock the background layer to make sure that whatever buttons they would press, the screen would never turn dark. And with that little personal story, I will end this tutorial. If the locking content method is not really working for you, then make sure to check out our tutorial on persistent clips, which is a different approach to maintaining content. If you have any questions, drop them in the comment section below, and I will see you in the next one.